Tissue injury results in activation of the cyclooxygenase, lipooxygenase and kinins. Simultaneously, nerve impulses are transmitted to the brain through the spinal cord. Acute pain is sharp and transmitted by the A-delta fibers. Pain sensation is felt by the sensory cortex and the CNS is sensitized to pain. Chronic, dull pain is transmitted by the C-fibers. Pain as an emotion lasts for a longer duration than the injury and is mediated by the basal ganglia. Local anesthesia at the surgical site or spinal anesthesia if below the umbilicus blocks both A-delta and C-fibers. General anesthesia acts at the higher level. Thus anesthesia blocks transmission of pain sensation. It also blocks the central sensitization to pain. NACIDs act at the tissue level but they block only cyclooxygenase without blocking lipooxygenase and kinins. Thus they don't act completely to shut down the pain. Opioids act on the basal ganglia and they block chronic pain and pain as an emotion. The fun fact is that opioids started before tissue damage, also known as preemptive analgesia, require a reduced dosage as opposed to higher doses needed if started after the injury.